So if you step over here, this here is uh, a sample of the two doors that will go on on one cabinet. So we have the two door frames ready to accept the raised panel inside. When it's all finished, it will overlay a half inch on the opening and leave about 330 seconds gap in the middle. That creates a shadow line that separates these two pieces. If not, you get that tight. It looks like you made a mistake and made this center rail too wide. So the shadow line shows you that everything is symmetrical. So that would be for a 24 by 32 inch tall cabinet. This one's for a 32 by 32 inch tall cabinet. So again, we, we have our, our pieces that fit together. Put the other one in. Bring the other rail in, or the other style, I'm sorry. Starts in. And all that holds this together, there's no, no major no metal fasteners, it's just glue. And it's an incredible surface around this glue joint. You have incredible glue surface between these. When this goes together, all this gets gl a glue in it. And so it's an incredibly strong joint when it's together. So anyway, there's the next widest door. That's going to be for a wider cabinet. And that's it. So just have to make up a raised panel and we'll go from there. Okay. That's it.